Alright guys, so we do have some interesting news for the global version of Doken Battle. We are coming up on the 1000 day celebration or the 1000 day login for global. And if you're one of the person or one of the people I should say that have been playing the game since day one and you've been logging in every single day for the entirety of the thousand days and you will get, boom, this LR Goku, which is a very good LR Goku. He is probably, he probably has the best leader building in the game because of how diverse it is. It's three key 100% stats to all typing. So that's, that's the highest stat buff for a rainbow leader in the game. Like, that's amazing. I am a far away from having him because on Global, uh, I'm, I actually have more days accumulated on GP than I have on Global because I started, you know, JP earlier. So, I'm a while away from this guy on Global. Uh, I'll probably get him on JP before I get him on Global because, once again, I have more days accumulated on my JP account. But a very good unit. He'll be dropping on the 30th of this month, which is actually, uh, is that Friday or Saturday? I think it might be Saturday, possibly. So, this guy will be available Saturday. Now, oh, and we're also going to get the Doken Awakening of B-Pan. And we're going to get the free-to-play Raditz. Now, this Raditz is actually pretty good. When he does drop, I do recommend you guys farm him up. Uh, he does not get free orbs, unfortunately. He should get free orbs. I don't know why they didn't give him free orbs, but he just is what it is. Um, but whatever. I mean, you know, somewhat of a solid unit. That's for free-to-play, of course. He is the low-class Warriors category leader. Uh, four key and... Uh, wait, what? Uh, four key... And 40% HP and defense and 80% attack. That's, that's actually not horrible. It's actually not too bad, honestly. Uh, he, he he does AoE. So he'll hit everyone in the field and lower defense. Lower defense does nothing, but he does AoE. So that's pretty cool. Passive is, you know, I mean, free to play, whatever. Um, attack 50% start of turn. He gets an additional 6 key and 30% attack. What? But, but why though? <laughs> why though? Uh, he gets an additional 6 key. And 30% attack when facing two or more enemies. So, bring him to the World Tournament. If you do rainbow him, which I don't recommend you doing that, then he can one-shot up to, uh, yeah, he can one-shot up to, I believe it's, uh, floor 12 or something? Well, no, uh, the, uh, the, the times, I think up to times 10 difficulty. But he can't one-shot 30 or anything like that, because, you know, free-to-play and it's not that great, honestly. But, uh, solid, but not great. Now, what might come that we don't know anything about is this. Now, if you remember on JP, JP had a 1,000-day ticket celebration, which was right here, as you can see. Now, this banner featured all of the 120 leaders, all of them, all of the 70% leaders, all of the 100% uh, mono leaders, all the three key 3,000 stat leaders. There's Merge Zamasu, Ray Trunks, the Super Leader being Blue Vegito, the uh, Villains Leader being Super Saiyan Rose. Literally, all of the Doken Fest cards, all of them, are on this banner. So, I want us to come to Global. Uh, we have not taken banner in quite a while. It's been definitely a minute. A very long minute of that. I mean, I'm in this forever, man. So, I'm sick of waiting this long. freaking minute, Bandai. But, I don't see why this wouldn't come. Um, we need one. <laughs> it's been too long. So... You know, how the ticket bonus work is that you will get one ticket for every 50 stones you spend in the game. So, that includes stamina refills, that includes box space, um, expansion, and of course, summons. So, whatever amount of stones you spend between a certain period of time, you'll get one ticket based on the, well, tickets uh, for the amount of stones you spent. So, you can have upwards of, you know, hundreds and hundreds of uh, tickets. Like for me, I spent quite a quite a bit of tickets on Global, so I should have, you know, quite a bit uh, sorry, I spent a quite a, quite a bit of stones on Global. I should have quite a bit of tickets uh, for the amount of stones I spent. Um, I don't have, you know, for example, I don't have, you know, Super Saiyan 3 Roly. I don't have... I need a dupe of Gogeta to rainbow him. Um, I need Kid Buu dupes. I need uh, cooler dupes. Cell dupes. Uh, I mean, I kind of have a lot of stuff here. I need, I guess, Broly dupes. Ultimate Gohan dupes. I want dupes of the uh, three key and three thousand stat units, like the Super Saiyan three Goku that's just got his easy awakening, uh, the Int Ultimate Gohan. Like I, I really want these guys above anyone else. Like I really don't need any of the one twenty leaders. Besides, like wait, Super. Se oh, I was just about to say Super Seventeen. Okay, I need Super Seventeen. I don't have him. 
I want Omega Shinron dupes because I want to rainbow him. Like, yeah, I, I could take dupes, but obviously just kind of banner. There's so many featured cards. Like, so there's 35 featured cards. There's 35 featured cards. The chance of you pulling one specific card is very, 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 very low. So don't hope on this banner. Don't, like, if if you want to get a full power Frieza, don't hope on getting a full power Frieza because you might not even pull him. I don't care how many tickets you have. There's a ton of featured units, and most likely you'll pull someone else more than half the time. But uh, I don't know why this wouldn't come to global once again because it's a thousand ticket banner and. We're about to hit our thousand days, so that's interesting. So, a uh, very quick video. Thought I'd draw this video real quick, guys, to let you guys know what's going on. Thousand day Goku's coming. B Pan Doken Awakening, who is actually a very, very good unit. She is only one of two free to play units who I would actually give orbs to. I actually gave orbs to my B Pan on JP and my um, Super Saiyan 2 Kaba on JP because her passive is very good. She does heal you when she, um, you know, does damage. So she does get some crits, then that's quite a bit of healing. So I did give her some orbs, just uh, just enough for her to crit, because the healing is so valuable. Like you know, in Super Battle Road, her healing did come in clutch for me when she, uh, you know, sent, when she crit and everything. So I would recommend at least giving her level twenty critical, if you know that's my recommendation, because she's just that good, uh, in my opinion, that is. Um, but anyways, guys, so yeah, very quick video. Hope you enjoy the video. Those out there, once again, enjoy your LR Goku, because if you were here uh, to do the thousand logins every single damn day then i mean you know congrats to you but i i didn't do that shit uh thank you once again guys very quick video sorry if i sound kind of bad i am actually uh, catching a cold so uh the boys a little under the weather uh the, under the weather right now but uh yeah that is what it is so i'll see you next time bye bye yeah! i will not let you destroy my world